If you guys have been playing Epic 7 after the patch, you guys might have noticed that the way you promote units has been completely reworked. Now instead of needing Phantasma and Fodder, you actually just need a currency now, which you can actually get from actually turning in your Phantasma that you have in your inventory. We have three sets of currency here, Lesser Spirit Blooms, Greater Spirit Blooms, and Epic Spirit Blooms. One Greater Spirit Bloom is equal to five Lesser Spirit Blooms, and one Epic Spirit Bloom is equal to five Greater Spirit Blooms, or 25 Lesser Spirit Blooms. So basically you need five of the lower tier to go up one tier um, and convert it, which it'll automatically do for you if you actually don't have enough of the uh, blooms so the way this works now is like i said you want to turn in your phantasma for this currency and everywhere you used to get phantasma you'll actually be able to get those spirit blooms for example guys the guild shop used to sell actually a giga phantasma every single month that you could purchase with currency but now you're going to see it is replaced with the purple epic spirit bloom which is going to be used to actually promote five star units into six star units likewise in the transmit stone shop you can also buy greater spirit blooms for three silver transmit stones which we were able to buy phantasma from as well so this currency guys basically just replaced phantasma altogether but it'll make it a lot easier to promote your units in the sense that your inventory will be less cluttered um, but we're going to talk about some of the drawbacks as well so basically the way you promote units guys pretty much the same thing you click promote and you're going to see it cost you currency for example if i want to level up this fodder i need two lesser spirit blooms uh, which you can also summon in the forest of souls by the way similar to how mega phantasma were summoned for stigma uh, the thing is though you don't really need these actually anymore these fodder two star pieces because of the fact that you can just directly level up three star units with penguins and then directly promote them without any fodder now you just need these lesser spirit blooms what you want to do with your fodder now actually is just transmit it because it'll give you stigma which is going to be very very important to actually buy those spirit blooms from the forest of souls um, or not buy but rather you know summon them and craft them because you need them to actually promote your units now so looking at our units again if i can scroll all the way up you're gonna see that the fodder took two which you don't really care about the three star unit will take 12 lesser spirit blooms and now the four star unit if you want to promote it to five star will take 16 greater spirit blooms so if you multiply that by five you get 80 lesser spirit blooms and the last one five star unit to six star this is going to take a lot it is going to take 20 epic spirit blooms which is going to be equal to 100 greater spirit blooms or 500 lesser spirit blooms you need a lot so you know this system actually simplifies things but it also actually slows down especially if you have a lot of gold to spare like i do if you're trying to promote your units because it'll require to have you to have a lot of stigma you're going to want a lot of stigma because basically the way you actually do this is go to the growth altar and then you actually summon from the spirit well here as you can see you can summon the lessers you can summon the uh, graders and you can summon the epics as well and they are very very expensive now although these stigma costs have gone up keep in mind that stigma is available in higher amounts now from adventure and science stories you can start you can actually farm it faster there but also keep in mind stigma is being farmed from hunts as well so if you are spamming hunts and even like spirit altar you'll still be getting currency to actually you know promote your units however guys if you guys are in the late game you're not really hurting on gold this is a big issue because you actually can't promote units as quickly anymore. The reason is, is because in the past, what you would do actually, if you have a lot of gold, like look at my gold, 230 mil basically, you would basically just buy all of these uh, fodder every time you refresh while you're looking for bookmarks and also mystic metals. And what you would actually do is level up with penguins and make it super, super fast to actually level up your uh, characters. Reason being that you actually buy fodder to actually promote your fodder. And also you can actually you know use them as EXP as well if you run out of EXP and also just spam your penguins with stigma as well overall it is a slower way to promote if you if you actually used to spam the shop but for newer players i can see this being a big help because you're also going to be farming stigma while doing hunts and stuff like that i think this overall change is pretty confusing just think of it this way phantasma is replaced with spirit blooms you don't need fodder anymore at all and basically you want to make sure you save all your stigma now and use it in the forest of the souls to buy those spirit blooms to upgrade your units that being said that's pretty much it for this video guys just wanted to clarify on the system because it is pretty confusing i was pretty confused at first as well and i hope you guys have a great weekend and this video helped you out peace